Top 10 Most Dangerous Foods That People Keep Eating Every Day Hello everybody! In a world where our daily meals can be ticking time bombs for our health, it's imperative to decode the warning signs and confront the alarming reality of the perilous foods we consume without a second thought. Brace yourself for a shocking revelation, the seemingly innocent items on your plate could be stealthily conspiring against your well-being. Imagine this scenario, with each bite, you unknowingly ingest a cocktail of harmful substances, setting off a chain reaction within your body. These culprits, disguised as ordinary foods, are the saboteurs behind your dwindling energy, foggy mind, restless nights, and disrupted metabolism. But fear not, because today, we embark on a mission to unmask the top 10 dietary villains that pose an imminent threat to your health. This isn't just a wake-up call, it's a call to action. We arm you with actionable tips to navigate your meals safely, ensuring you enjoy both flavor and well-being. Stick around until the end, and here's the kicker, we've got a special surprise waiting for you, something that will forever change the way you approach your meals. Now, let's uncover the truth together. 1. Processed Meats Processed meats, such as bacon, hot dogs, and deli meats, have become dietary staples for many, but recent revelations underscore their status as some of the most harmful foods. The World Health Organization, WHO, has taken a decisive stance, categorizing processed meats as a Group 1 carcinogen, equating their cancer-causing potential to substances like tobacco and asbestos. At the heart of the issue lies the inclusion of nitrates in these processed products. While nitrites are commonly added for preservation and flavor enhancement, their conversion during processing can lead to the formation of nitrosamines, known carcinogens. This scientific connection between processed meats and an increased cancer risk underscores the need for caution in their consumption. Beyond the cancer concerns, processed meats have been linked to arterial stiffness, disrupting the natural elasticity of blood vessels. This disruption contributes to elevated blood pressure, heightening the risk of heart-related complications. Research from the University of Oxford highlights this risk, revealing an 18% increase in the likelihood of coronary heart disease for every 50 grams of daily processed meat consumption. Given these compelling findings, a prudent approach to dietary choices is crucial. To mitigate associated health risks, it is advisable to limit or, if possible, entirely avoid processed meats. For those who choose to include them in their diet, opting for organic and nitrate-free alternatives emerges as a potentially safer option. The revelations about processed meats prompt us to question our dietary habits, but the intrigue deepens as we shift our focus to fried foods, exploring the impact of oil-immersed delicacies on our well-being. 2. Fried Foods Fried foods, the second ominous contender in the list of top 10 most dangerous foods that people keep eating every day, reveal specific health hazards associated with its preparation method. Deep frying involves submerging foods in hot oil, resulting in the absorption of detrimental trans fats. A comprehensive analysis of trans fat consumption, supported by data from the American Heart Association, highlights its role in increasing LDL cholesterol levels, contributing to heart disease. Research indicates that each 2% increase in energy intake from trans fats is associated with a 23% increase in coronary heart disease risk. The cooking process itself introduces another peril as it leads to the formation of acrylamide, a potentially carcinogenic substance. Studies from the National Cancer Institute demonstrate that acrylamide is formed when certain foods, particularly those high in carbohydrates, are cooked at high temperatures. The correlation between acrylamide exposure and an elevated risk of several types of cancer, including ovarian and kidney cancers, raises alarming concerns. Furthermore, the high caloric content in fried foods is a key contributor to the global obesity epidemic. According to the World Health Organization, WHO, worldwide obesity has nearly tripled since 1975, and in 2016, more than 1.9 billion adults were overweight, with 650 million classified as obese. Obesity is a major risk factor for numerous health conditions, such as type 2 diabetes, cardiovascular diseases, and certain cancers. 
the narrative of the risks posed by fried foods unveils a larger concern when we pair the allure of deep-fried delights with the commonplace habit of consuming sugary drinks. This tandem raises a poignant question, are we unwittingly cultivating a daily routine that significantly heightens the health risks we expose ourselves to? Let's continue. 3. Sugary Drinks The correlation between an excessive intake of sugar-laden beverages, particularly sodas, and the burgeoning rates of obesity is not merely speculative, it's a stark reality. The latest data from the World Health Organization, WHO, serves as a global alarm, revealing that a staggering 13% of the world's adult population grapples with obesity. This epidemic is intimately entwined with the pervasive consumption of sugary beverages, acting as a catalyst for weight gain and laying the groundwork for the onset of metabolic disorders, notably type 2 diabetes. Delving deeper into the health repercussions, it becomes apparent that the impact extends beyond expanding waistlines. A recent study featured in the Journal of the American Dental Association unfolds a compelling narrative, providing irrefutable evidence linking the regular intake of sugary drinks to an increased susceptibility to cavities and gum diseases. The acidic composition of these beverages not only heightens the risk of dental maladies but also poses a dual threat by accelerating enamel erosion, compromising the very foundation of our oral health. We've talked extensively about sugary drinks, and I believe there's no longer any doubt about their harmful effects on health. However, there's another habit occurring daily that you might even be praising for its supposed special benefits. Well, be cautious about the upcoming content that I'm about to reveal to you. 4. Breakfast Cereals Breakfast cereals, often hailed as a convenient and nutritious start to the day, harbor unique health hazards that merit close examination. Scientific research and specific data reveal that beneath the guise of wholesome goodness, certain breakfast cereals may pose risks to our well-being. A critical aspect of concern is the high sugar content prevalent in many commercially available cereals. Recent studies, including research published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, underscore the association between excessive sugar intake and an increased risk of obesity, type 2 diabetes, and cardiovascular issues. The misleading health claims on cereal packaging may contribute to a false sense of nutritional security, leading consumers to overlook the potential pitfalls. Additionally, the refining process of grains in breakfast cereals often results in the loss of essential nutrients, leaving behind a product with limited nutritional value. Research from the Journal of Nutrition and Metabolism emphasizes that a diet rich in refined grains may contribute to inflammation and increase the risk of chronic diseases. There is another food similar to breakfast cereals that is also subtly infiltrating your daily habits, do you know what it is? 5. Refined Grains Refined grains, often integral to modern diets, reveal unique health hazards that warrant meticulous consideration. Scientific scrutiny and specific data accentuate the potential drawbacks hidden within these commonly consumed grains. One significant concern revolves around the refining process, which strips grains of their bran and germ, leaving behind a product lacking essential nutrients. Studies underscore that diets high in refined grains may contribute to inflammation, insulin resistance, and an increased risk of chronic diseases like heart disease and diabetes. Moreover, Refined grains often possess a high glycemic index, leading to rapid spikes in blood sugar levels. Research from the Archives of Internal Medicine connects diets rich in high glycemic foods, including refined grains, to an elevated risk of developing type 2 diabetes. 6. Trans fats Our exploration delves into the scientific realm, unveiling the alarming connections between these artificial fats and heightened cardiovascular risks. Trans fats, once ubiquitous in processed and fried foods, emerge as a significant dietary peril, substantiated by a plethora of scientific evidence. Extensive studies, exemplified by a comprehensive analysis in the New England Journal of Medicine, unequivocally establish the ominous connection between trans fat consumption and a heightened risk of coronary heart disease. Data reveal that for each 2% increase in energy intake from trans fats, the risk of coronary heart disease rises significantly. 
the detrimental impact of trans fats isn't confined to cardiovascular health alone. Research from the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition underscores their role in promoting systemic inflammation, a precursor to chronic diseases such as diabetes and inflammatory disorders. The pervasive presence of trans fats in certain food products poses a silent health threat, despite increasing awareness. In response to these findings, the World Health Organization, WHO, advocates for the global elimination of industrially produced trans fats, emphasizing their role in preventing premature deaths and promoting overall health. Notably, Denmark's successful trans fat ban has demonstrated tangible health benefits, with a significant reduction in cardiovascular disease-related deaths. Continuing with the hazards from the ocean, have you ever wondered what lies behind the allure of raw shellfish? Let's explore together. 7. Raw Shellfish Raw shellfish, often celebrated for its culinary appeal, conceals specific health hazards that demand careful consideration. Scientific studies, including a comprehensive analysis featured in the Journal of Food Protection, shed light on the unique risks associated with the consumption of uncooked shellfish. One primary concern revolves around the potential presence of harmful pathogens, including bacteria and viruses, in raw shellfish. The U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, CDC, reports a significant number of foodborne illnesses linked to the consumption of raw or undercooked shellfish. Pathogens such as Vibrio vulnificus and norovirus pose severe health threats, leading to gastrointestinal issues and, in extreme cases, life-threatening complications. Furthermore, raw shellfish can accumulate environmental contaminants, including heavy metals and toxins, which may have detrimental effects on human health. Research from the Environmental Science and Technology Journal highlights the bioaccumulation of contaminants in shellfish, underscoring the potential risks associated with their consumption. Continuing with the vastness of the ocean, where shell-bearing creatures take us to another hidden realm deep beneath the sea. Are the fish on your plate truly safe? Let's proceed. 8. High Mercury Fish High mercury fish, renowned for its nutritional richness, becomes a double-edged sword due to its susceptibility to mercury contamination. In-depth scientific studies, as highlighted in research published in Environmental Health Perspectives, illuminate the intricate dangers associated with elevated mercury levels in certain fish species, introducing nuanced considerations for health-conscious consumers. Mercury, a potent neurotoxin, permeates the oceans and accumulates in fish, particularly predatory species. The potential repercussions are significant, especially for vulnerable populations like pregnant women and young children. Scientific data from the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency, EPA, underscores the necessity of caution, as high mercury exposure can impair the developing nervous systems. Predatory fish, including shark, swordfish, and king mackerel, occupy the upper echelons of the marine food chain, accumulating higher mercury concentrations. This raises concerns about the safety of regularly consuming such species. Striking a balance between the nutritional benefits of fish and minimizing mercury exposure becomes crucial, prompting a reassessment of dietary choices. 9. Raw or undercooked eggs Raw or undercooked eggs pose a distinct health hazard, requiring careful consideration due to the potential presence of harmful bacteria, primarily salmonella. Scientific studies, such as a comprehensive analysis published in the Journal of Food Protection, underscore the link between consuming raw or undercooked eggs and an increased risk of salmonella infection. Salmonella's horror story unfolds in the form of debilitating symptoms, ranging from nausea, vomiting, and abdominal cramps to more severe complications, including bloodstream infections. Vulnerable populations, such as the elderly, infants, and individuals with weakened immune systems, are particularly susceptible to the devastating effects of a salmonella infection. In extreme cases, the consequences can be fatal. The prevalence of salmonella contamination in eggs is a concerning reality. The bacteria can be present both on the shell surface and within the egg, infiltrating the porous structure despite the egg appearing intact. Despite common misconceptions, simply washing eggs doesn't eliminate the risk, 
as salmonella can persist within the eggshell's pores. Even seemingly fresh and high-quality eggs are not immune to this risk. The intricate structure of an egg, with its porous shell, provides an ideal environment for bacterial entry. The story of salmonella bacteria proves that proper food handling is extremely crucial. However, there are certain foods that, even when cooked or boiled thoroughly, may still pose risks. What are they? 10. Unnaturally grown animal products. Attention to all consumers of animal products. Opting for grass-fed instead of grain-fed meat might just be the health-conscious choice you need. While meat is undoubtedly a valuable source of protein, vitamin B12, enzymes, and antioxidants, the quality of the meat matters significantly. Factory-farmed meat, particularly from animals that predominantly consume corn and soy, can lead to a detrimental imbalance of omega-6 and omega-3 fatty acids. Studies, including research published in the Journal of Biomedicine and Pharmacotherapy, link this imbalance to inflammation, contributing to a spectrum of health issues such as cancer, cardiovascular diseases, rheumatoid arthritis, and autoimmune diseases. The recommended balance of omega-6 to omega-3 fatty acids is 1 to 1, as per human evolution. However, the contemporary Western diet averages around 15 to 1 due to the prevalence of processed foods and factory farming practices. Grass-fed meat, eggs, chicken, and fish emerge as healthier alternatives. Grass-fed meat boasts higher levels of omega-3 fatty acids and conjugated linoleic acid, CLA, essential for preventing chronic diseases and maintaining healthy cartilage. Opting for organic, Pasture-raised eggs and chicken ensures a natural diet, higher vitamin D levels, and increased omega-3 fatty acids and vitamin E content. Additionally, wild-caught fish, such as salmon, outshines farm-raised counterparts in nutritional value, with lower toxin levels, reducing the risk of cancer, liver damage, and developmental problems. The question that looms large, are we ready to invest in naturally grown food to safeguard our health, potentially avoiding long-term medical costs and enhancing our overall quality of life? Of course, I'm not suggesting that all of us should spend a large amount of money every day to buy clean, clearly certified sourced foods. What I mean is, why don't we create and combine fantastic foods based on smart choices beyond the market and make it right in our own small kitchen? Do you agree with me? Leave a comment below this video. I've spent a lot of time gathering information and conducting comprehensive research to make videos for you, so if you find the video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. And now, thank you for watching until the end of this video. Stay tuned for my next video. As always, wishing you good health.